Hi everyone, wanna come welcome back to my channel. Today I will be making masala fried chicken. I have 800 grams of chicken here with bone skin off. I've made these cuts on each piece of chicken so that the masala penetrates well and flavors the chicken. Also, I've made some cut here on the thick part of the bone so that the chicken cooks fast. So it's just kind of exposing the bone so that it fries quickly and fast. For the marinade masala, we need one tablespoon of ginger, half tablespoon of garlic, one small shallot, two green chilies, and one root and stem of a coriander. To this, we'll add juice of one lime or lemon. So this will help us to grind with no need to add water so we grind this into a smooth paste so that's our ginger garlic shallot coriander roots and green chili paste so we add our chicken into our mixing bowl we add in our ginger garlic paste salt according to taste freshly ground black pepper one teaspoon red chili flakes, half teaspoon turmeric powder, two teaspoon red chili powder, one heaped teaspoon cumin powder, two heaped teaspoon coriander powder, one teaspoon garam masala powder, one teaspoon chaat masala powder, one tablespoon corn flour and one tablespoon rice flour to make it extra crispy one tablespoon mustard oil adds in a nice smoky flavor now we mix this all together and coat each and every piece of the chicken well make sure the masala goes into every cut that we made on the chicken now we cover this with a cling wrap This goes in the fridge for at least two hours and overnight would be perfect. Take the chicken out half an hour before you're ready to fry it. Make sure your chicken is at room temperature before it hits the hot oil. We will be deep frying the chicken, so make sure you have enough oil in the pot. Just stick a wooden spoon in the oil. If it's bubbling like this, the oil is ready. Let's fry our chicken. We fry our chicken in batches, so make sure you don't overcrowd the pot. So we cook the chicken pieces for four to five minutes on each side, making sure it's nice and cooked through and crispy on the outside. Then we'll be ready to serve. That's our first batch done. You can see how the chicken is crispy. This is a nice breast piece and it's cooked through. It's nice and juicy. Yum. Our last batch is done. Let's serve these. If you enjoy eating fried chicken, this is the recipe for you. This is a cracker of a recipe. You will enjoy making it and you will love eating it. Please like, share and subscribe to my channel. And I promise to bring you amazing and easy recipes you and your family will enjoy. Thanks for your time. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.